time for some tech news that you can use. And we welcome to see you morning live, Bill Margison, who is uh, you're the CEO of CBL Data Recovery Technologies. You're one of the experts worldwide in data recovery because it's a huge issue on many levels, not just for us at home and wanting to hang on to our, I mean, but uh, of course, uh, law enforcement agencies and government. I mean, serious information that has to be recovered. And you are the guys that work the miracle <laughs> pulling this data out of uh, what you know, presumably are you know, toasted dry. So we want to get the ABCs here, Bill. Okay. Uh, what I wanted to show this morning was a number of things. First, how, how disk drives have evolved and how my job's gotten tougher over the years. Yeah. There was a time when the disk drives were large, easy to work on. The joke was you could see the data going by. <laughs> But not anymore. Uh, this, this drive would have been uh, uh, about 20 megabytes. Um, this would have cost about $1,800. So if we, uh, you know, back to the future, that's about 30 gigs right there. That's right. Yeah. Gigs, not megs. Right. 30 um, gigs, yeah. Yeah, this was, sorry, you said this was how many? Uh, 20 megs? To 30 gigabytes. So, yeah. Huge. And of course, today, uh, as people get get more digitally invested, uh, there, last year there were there are 420 million disk drives manufactured and shipped. This year, there'll be 15 percent more. Yeah. And are they all now back to the consumer? Are all created equal, or are there things we should be right out of the gate, out of the box, things we should be looking for spec wise? Um, I I have a saying: Don't believe the hype. They're all about the same. The manufacturers buy all their components from the same sub suppliers. Mm -hmm. Uh, they all do a very, very good job. I've had the opportunity to visit some factories, and I know when these products leave the back door, they are absolutely perfect. However, by the time it comes from Malaysia or China, it yep. gets all the way to here and in your computer, yep. it may be a problem. Okay, so and there's two specific types of problems. There's the physical damage, and then there's what's called the logical damage. More common and better news. Yes, yes. yes. Physical's a big problem. Uh, drive still for a number of reasons. Um, that's where we come into play. We have a, a laboratory-based service, uh, clean rooms. We open the drives up, move platters around, do whatever it takes. Physic uh, logical problems you can do yourself. Mm -hmm. uh, there should be some maintenance done on your on your PC what at all times. Um, for, you have to defrag on a regular basis, uh, especially new OSs today, mm -hmm. and do all the regular stuff: malware, antivirus, and a firewall. Uh, but uh, the, the most important thing is to pay attention to your PC. Look so, for the click of death. Oh my goodness! Yeah, you have, you have an yeah. example for that. I, I have one here. It sounds very innocent. Uh, well, that's Murphy's Law Live TV. But normally, this is a toasted drive. Yep. This was actually a, a business. Their entire. Oh, well, I'm hearing it. It's quiet. No, see, mine might fix it up. There's a clicking there. Very subtle, very small, and that's actually fatal for that drive. So if your drive makes any new noises whatsoever, power down, nothing you can do to fix it, mm -hmm. nothing at all. Yeah. You need to set it to a lab like ours. Wow. And, you know, it's a big issue these days, too, uh, identity theft, uh, right at the top of the list. You were mentioning you were in Singapore at a conference, and actually you did a test. Uh, tell us a story about this drive that uh, you guys got into. Well, they, they, they approached us with three different drives, and they said, pick one, and we mm -hmm. did it random. Yeah. And then we went to, to do what we do best. We work at not the operating system level, but a lower level, a hex level. And we found three distinct personalities on the drive. The drive had been used by three people prior. We found one guy's email, another fellow's banking record. Three separate identities on one drive. drive. Presumably, the, you know, one was erased, but no, it's, the stuff is still there. You actually liken it to a book. Yes, yes, I, I, it's a good analogy, actually. This drive would be like a, a book. The book has a table of contents, and let's say 10 chapters, 10 pages each. Well, um, the table of contents runs everything. If I were to erase a page, I don't really erase the page. I change the entry in the table of contents. It's not until I overwrite that page with new data mm -hmm. or zeros that I have literally... So that's another piece of advice, too. If the drive is toast, don't just throw it in the garbage. That's right. Just <laughs> drive over it, whatever you have to do, but destroy it so there's no way. Because that stuff's you know, on there. That's right. If you're going to sell it on eBay, you're going to have to wipe this drive. Uh, we, we have for free on our website, by the way, uh, some software that will wipe it oh. uh, for you. To, to government standards, Department of Defense. We'll end on that note. CBLTech.com is the website. Wish we had more time. We'll have to have you back. Thanks, Bill. We're going to be back in two minutes with the news at 8.30 and more CH Morning Live on the way.